Okay, you're in Microsoft Word and you want to be able to reference a particular footnote or endnote multiple times. So in my document, I currently have two footnotes, footnote one and footnote two. What I want to do is reference footnote one a second time. So I'll do that here. Now what I do is I go to the References tab on the ribbon. I click on the Cross Reference button. In the Reference Type drop-down, I choose Footnote. In the Insert Reference 2 drop-down, I choose Footnote Number Formatted, and then I choose the footnote I want to reference. So for me, that's Footnote 1, and then I just click on Insert, and then Close. And there we have the footnote reference. Now, what happens if I add a, another footnote, so a completely new footnote, above the original Footnote 1? So let's do that here. I'll insert a footnote. I'll call this footnote zero. So now footnote one is referenced with the number two. And if I go back to the original footnote reference, you can see that that's automatically updated to two. However, the footnote reference that I inserted with the cross-reference dialog box hasn't updated automatically. Now that's easy to resolve. What you'd need to do, first of all, is select the whole document, so Control A, and then use the F9 key at the top of your keyboard, and that updates all the fields in your document. Now the same method will also work for EndNotes. What I'm gonna do is confer all my footnotes to EndNotes. So now I have EndNotes rather than footnotes in my document. There they are. So I want to refer to footnote zero a second time in my document. So I'll do this here. Place my cursor where I want the footnote reference. I go to the cross reference button. Insert reference type, which will be EndNote. Insert reference two, EndNote number formatted. And then I choose the EndNote that I want to refer to. These are still named footnotes, but they're now EndNotes. So I click on Insert, I click on Close. So now you can see my EndNote reference number there. But you'll have the same problem with automatic renumbering of these reference numbers. So if I add another EndNote reference before an existing EndNote reference, let's insert it there. I'll call this EndNote 0. You can see that the original EndNote reference automatically numbers, but the one I inserted with the cross-reference dialog box hasn't renumbered. So again, what I do is I select the whole document, Control A, and then F9 at the top of my keyboard, and it updates all the reference numbers. Okay, that's all I wanted to cover in this particular video. Hopefully that's useful. If it is, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe, and I'll see you next video.